The site of the accident, Jindo, and the city most touched by the tragedy, Ansan, have been declared special disaster areas. This means they will now have access to special emergency funds and the government will cover the vast majority of the costs. For more on this, we connect live to Ashin Semin, standing by at the new centre. Semin. Good morning, Mark. As you say, the government has officially declared the two areas affected by the accident special disaster zones. Ansan in Gyeonggi-do province and Chindogun County in the southwestern province of Cheollanam-do are the two areas designated. Ansan is where the Tanwon High School is located, and the students there made up a majority of the passengers on board the ill-fated ferry. And Chindo is where the Sewolho ferry capsized last Wednesday, and it's also where Pengmokang Harbor is located the closest harbor to the accident site. These two areas will be able to receive state funds that goes to search and rescue operations. And local taxes, including acquisition tax, will also be waived for those in the area. Others, other general taxes will also be reduced, will either be reduced or the deadline for the payment will be postponed for up to nine months. Also, financial assistance will be provided for the victims and their families, including those still waiting for news of their loved ones. Now, a clearer picture has started to emerge on the time around the capsize with the release uh, by the Coast Guards of that conversation we heard in the report before between the vessel controllers and the ship. But prosecutors are also broadening their investigations into the crew and also the ferry's operator. Yes, Mark. Prosecutors say they will look into the mistakes made while sailing the ferry, the botched ex evacuation attempt, and early rescue efforts and other related matters such as the extension of the cabin on the ferry. The Chungajin Shipping Company will also be investigated, as well as some 20 crewmen and the captain, Lee jun -suk. The prosecutors also banned the family that owned the shipping company from leaving the country, as the investigation may be extended. A special task force will be also organized for the urgent investigation on the case uh, on the cause of the capsizing cases of phone scams and smishing or the SMS phishing for text messages de de designed to lure naive people after the ferry disaster will also be thoroughly investigated and the investigators have also requested to search and confiscate files from the popular messaging application Kakao Talk here in the nation to try and place together the accident using the text messages sent and received by the passengers on board and the messaging corporation has agreed to fully cooperate in the probe mark okay thank you very much for the update sam in we'll connect to you throughout the day